Hi there! In this video, we're going to show you how you can use the Cask to Maya bridge to speed up your workflow. To install the bridge, just drag and drop the Maya Cask installer file into the viewport in Maya. Several windows will pop up during the installation process, so you'll just need to wait a bit. Once installed, this new menu will appear. So the installation is now complete. Now, if you have a character in Cascadeur, you can easily transfer it to Maya. It is best, however, to revert the character into the rig pose before exporting. To do that, select all of the character's box controllers, go to Commands, go to T-Pose. Now to send it to Maya, go to Commands, Maya, Export Animation. Now in Maya, we can tweak our animation any way we want and send it back to Cascadeur. We have an option to send it either to the current scene or to create a new scene in Cascadeur. The export is done via selection sets. You can add or remove objects from them. Let's animate something simple just to see how this works. Now go to Cascadeur, Send to, New Scene. The animation was exported correctly without the head mesh, as we removed it from the set. To edit animation in Maya, you can create a control rig using the human eye case system. First, you need to create a character definition. The next thing to do is to link the character's joints to this mannequin. Now, as you can see, the character's arms are colored yellow, as human eye care requires the correct T-pose. So we need to tweak the position of the arms a bit to align them correctly. Once the pose is correct, the icons will turn green. You can then properly name the character and create a control rig. Once all done, you can now import the animation made in Cascadeur and apply it to this rig. Once transferred, the animation will be baked to the skeleton. To further work on it, you will have to rebake it to the control rig. You can then do whatever you want with this animation using the human IK rig. Also, if we have a ready-made character in Maya with human IK rig, it can be transferred to Cascadeur very easily. Go to Cascadeur editor menu. Click the add human IK button. Next, in the Rig Settings tab, you should specify the chest joint as well as the weapon joints if you have any. Now the character is ready to be transferred to Cascadeur. In Cascadeur, you can tweak things in the Rig mode if you need to. And that's it! And as always, if you have any questions, make sure to check out our Discord server, and thanks for watching.